Dear parent, guardian of Damacris Group of Schools, I'm glad to inform you that we have improved our services on Google Classroom by incorporating it with a platform known as G Suite for Education. G Suite for Education incorporates all our virtual e-learning tools, be it Zoom, Google Meet, Google Classroom, name them all, it puts them all of them together. To crown it all, G Suite has unique interactive tools, just to name one, Jamboard, where the teacher will fully interact with his or her learners effectively. Our high school uh, campus and classes six, seven, and eight are already using and enjoying G Suite for Education, or which what I can call the new Google Classroom. For our grade five to preschool, I kindly request you to do the following to enroll your child in the G Suite uh, account. It's very easy as because our grade six up to high school have just enrolled themselves without the help of parents. But we felt that grade five to preschool, you need some assistance from uh, the parents. The parents, you need to come in. So uh, please just follow the simple steps that I will show you here so that you can make sure that your child is in G Suite uh, account, that is G Suite for education. So let me just take my seat and explain to you slowly so that you can understand this. So the first thing uh, that uh, you do is your class teacher will send you a school email and a password. In G Suite, we are going to use school email and password. We are not going to use personal email. So your class teacher will send you an email and a password. Once you have been given your email by your class teacher and a password, it's very easy to join. So I want you to do the following on your child's gadget. Once you are given your email and password, just follow the simple steps that I'll give you so that you can successfully join the G Suite with your child. So the first thing that you need to do is to go to Google Chrome. Once you go to Google Chrome, on the search box, you type G Suite login then you press enter then the first option that comes there which says sign in google accounts g suite you click on that one now some of your phones or tablets might require some uh, confirmation before reaching this page so if it requires you to put a screen log password you do so until you reach this page uh, where you are supposed now to add a new account which is the new email and password that have, you have been given so you click add account now this is where you are now going to put the email that you have been given by your teacher so you type that email for my case here i have a child Okay, that child is called Juma. So we go to Juma. The email is Juma at one two three one Juma at one two three one at Dama Crest Schools. Dot .sc.ke dot So with this email, if you click on the next step and then you discover that it tells you invalid email, it is because you have not put the email correctly. You have to check on those letters which are in capital and those which are in small and you type it very correctly for it to go to the next step of password. So if you see that it's not going to the step of putting password, it means you are not putting it correctly. Then you enter the password as given, add one, two, three, one. Then I've successively uh, joined, this one has gone through. So you reach a page where you are supposed to accept the terms. It's good you go through the terms to understand the agreement between Google and the Democrat schools uh, in joining this G Suite for education. So once you go through this, you click on accept. Click on accept, click on accept to move to the next step. 
Now it will bring you to a page where now you are supposed to create a new password and confirm it for that child of yours. So not all of them will go through that stage, but if yours gets to a stage where you're supposed to now to create a new password, rather than the one you were given, you create that new password. So this password needs to be strong, but something that you can't forget, it requires you to do that. So once you are done with that, uh, it will take you to the dashboard. Now you can see your account is managed by damakreschools.sc.ke. Some of your gadgets might not bring you to this page, can take you to another page uh, where it takes you direct to the inbox. If it takes you to the inbox, you will look for invitation from the school. One of the uh, inbox will be invitation from either Margaret Kamau or Diana or Makima, inviting you to join the new classroom. You'll have to click join the new classroom. So for this one, it has taken me to the dashboard of Democrat Schools where we have now all these things I was talking about, and you can see the calendar, classroom, contacts, all of them put together, the Jamboard, everything else that the teacher and the pupils would be using in learning. So click on, click on, click on classroom, click on classroom. Once you click on classroom, it will take you to this page. It will take you to this page. It will take you to this page where you have now to continue. And then if you have to pick your role. Am I a student or a teacher? You are signing on behalf of the student, not the teacher. So you say, I'm a student. I'm a student, not a teacher. So you click that one. Once you click that, uh, it requests you to join the class in the class and you have successfully joined into the new G Suite classroom which looks just like the other classroom but has more features and which is more more uh, better than the other one so now once you are here you just use it the way you've been using the other classwork I mean the, the other Google Classroom, just the way you've been using it. You can go to check the people, the teachers, everything else. You can see the teachers who are there. We have the classmates, they have not yet joined, so we have the test child. And now this Yuma we have, who has entered, we have two students. So it's that easy, it's that easy. So once you get that email and password, try to go those steps until you find yourself into the new Google Classroom. As I've told you, if it doesn't take you to the dashboard and takes you into the inbox, once you get into the inbox of the new email, look for the invitation to join the new classroom. Uh, thank you and for your continued support and see you at G Suite.